So, I've played a lot of Lethal Company recently, and I always saw people making mods, and I wanted to give it a shot myself, and, well, this is what I made. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it makes the player smaller and adjusts other aspects of the player to help fit the size, such as a smaller jump height, less reach, slower movement, and the only benefit that you get is that you have infinite stamina to help save the sanity of anyone who plays this. And if you do enjoy the video, be sure to subscribe. I know that everybody says it, but it really does help out. And without further ado, let's get into the video. This is not something you see every day, having someone be up in the corner on the bed, currently small enough to fit in- hello. I forget what to type- I phys- I- like, if you- Moons. Moons. Okay, moons. Hit just pick a number. One, two, or three. This already brought up a huge issue. When we try to interact with the monitor, we can't actually see the screen of it, and because of that, we don't know what we are typing. So, we just naturally had to blindly guess what we were putting into it. Welcome to your first day on the job. This is your very own autopilot ship, where you will eat and sleep for the duration of your time. Okay. We'll be fine. If we have to fight the dog monster, I'm not gonna have fun. So, here's the thing. Not only is the is the difficulty in... I was talking. Yeah, so not only does it take 50 years to, like, walk to places, it's more difficult to actually get into the building. And to get back. Open up the game. What did you do? I don't... Uh, did, did you think this through? Follow me. I have an idea. <laughs> And because of our lack of jump height, we sometimes have to take a few unconventional ways to actually make it to the base. To be honest, I keep falling. Maybe if you... There we go. There we go, okay. <laughs> this feels so weird. Um, hey, uh, this is gonna look really funny. Where are you? I'm on my way. No. Oh! <laughs> Uh, I have no idea what it looks like big though, because I can't see. <laughs> <laughs> How on earth are you holding that? Is it locked? No. No. <gasps> oh wait, oh. wait. Can we go under these? Or is there collision still? I mean there is, but like At least with some of them you can kinda of, like go under. That oh, is really cool. Uh, a homemade flashbang. <laughs> wait, can you <laughs> How stupid does this look? It's still- oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Hear oh, me out. Oops. Ow. Bro. Oh, there's big things in here. Can't, we can't reach it. What do you mean? Oh, oh no! <laughs> wait, watch this. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, are you gaming? Trust me. <laughs> Wait, I, I, feel, I feel like this should be possible, but I don't know. Uh, oh, jeez! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. No, no, fight it. You have the flashbang. <laughs> Let's go fight it. But still, oh. It's, we can't jump over it. Wait, actually, up here, quick. I don't think it's gonna Come on. No, watch, trust. No, 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 trust, trust. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, actually, is there one side? I'm trying to think of how to get out of this. Watch. Three, two, one, go! Wait. Wait. Wait, we don't take damage from it. <laughs> oh wait, no, we do take damage! Oh no. Where did she take his stuff? Just leave me alone. Please. Oh my goodness. There's two. What are you doing? I'm cooking. What are you doing? You can 
can make it up, by the way. I've gone to the third level about three times now. Oh my. He's a short. <laughs> oh! <laughs> this, is so, this is so scary. I'm over. Okay. Um. You know what? Watch. <laughs> oh, cool. Well. I hear something walking. Uh. I don't know what it is, but. Oh, jeez! <laughs> Run! <laughs> I think you have to go in the fire one. <laughs> it's so much scarier to play this. Not just the size, but also we don't have anyone telling us where things are. Yeah, so... <laughs> what? Hey, it's your pickles! Oh, nice. <laughs> it looks so funny. <gasps> what the?! Fire escape, fire escape. Let's leave, 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 leave. leave. Ah! Get off of me! I can't see you! I can't see you! I can't see you! I'm sorry! <laughs> Run! Quick! Shoot, he's on his way! Oh! <laughs> Hear me out. I can't reach. Wait. Okay. I can probably get through here. Assuming there's one that has enough terrain here. <gasps> no! Well, that's depressing. I was so close. I think we have to that choose a different one. That was speaking the most sad, the saddest thing I've ever had to watch. So that gave us a goal. We wanted to find a way to get back to the ship with everything that we got in that level, but we first wanted to try out some other ones just to kind of get a feel for how the mod works. <gasps> in this moment, when death managed to make its way to me, I had no choice but to leave the rest of the mission up to my friend Newt, and surely he's doing something smart, right? <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> oh! No, he missed the sign! Pick it up, it's a weapon! Pick up the sign! Pick up the sign, it's literally right- Oh my gosh, she finally got it. He actually made it back though, that is impressive. Hello? Hey there. What the fuck? You have not met the perfect hole. Your performance has been doing Wait, the most Wait, here. Welcome to our disciplinary process. Watch. No, watch. Shoot. If we were playing normal Lethal Company, I feel like Newt could have made it back there, but unfortunately, we have less speed, so, you know. Get the items for you. It's flooding. Oh my goodness. No, it's <laughs> it's quicksand. <laughs> I got it. Wait, we, uh -oh. we have infinite stamina, though. Does that mean we just won't? Uh, uh, shit. Okay, this is our round. We are going to make $200,000. Be careful. Stop, make... stop, stop. Oh, fuck, not again. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. I told you to stop and you just... Um... <laughs> <laughs> Hear me out, trust. New, over here. We are tiny, which is... Ma which makes things difficult, but also easier. What's in here? Oh, there's a key. It's like a weapon. Wow, making the same joke as me, huh? Yeah.
Okay. <laughs> At least he dropped his stuff before trying it. Just need to, um... Oh, jeez! Please leave me alone, buddy. Can I outrun him? No! Take the stuff! Take the stuff! What the heck? He's so tall. Please, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Take the stuff. Take the stuff. No, I see the egg. The eggs that... It's a very difficult map on its own, so when you're tiny and can like hardly reach things, it's a lot am more difficult. Am I in for, am I in for uh, a ride? Yes. I also heard something last time that we were in here, so be careful. Me too, so <laughs> let's go. Um. I think we should take the what? other entrance. We should take the other entrance. It's mine. Look at him. Yeah, that's gonna attract. These, uh, this one. Wait. Oh, oh. Uh, can... Hey, you're gonna have to get that. Okay. Can you? I don't think you realize where I am. I hear something walking. Yeah. Um. I'm in a scaffolding. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, what? The... What? Oh my goodness. It's a, it's a giant, I think. Yeah. Don't go near it. Nope, I see the dead body thing. Um. No, why'd you make the ship leave? Oh, you made it! Go that way. In case you haven't played Lethal Company before, let's just say that this item is not a good thing to find. That's fucking terrifying anyways. What's wrong with you? Um, why are you normal sized? <laughs> No, that wasn't me. It killed me and took control of me. I was like, well, that's a really creepy mask. Wait, why are you normal size? <laughs> I don't. So, after some time, we then remember that the game has a ladder that you can buy for around $60 with using in game currency. Okay, stay there. I'm gonna move it slightly to the side. Are you still on it? Yeah. Moving it slightly over. Moving it, still on it. Moving it slightly over. We've ridden it slightly over. I have to go get the stuff one second. Okay, perfect. Now here's the thing. Can't reach this. We can just move it back. I know. But follow me. Yeah, that's the bird. Okay, yeah, but remember. watch this. This is how we are gonna get to places. Wait, one sec. This is how we're gonna get to places. Look at this. Place it so it like goes through here. Uh, that's not gonna. I'll bring it over. And with this, the entire game has opened up for us. Hey. Bottles, bottles, bottles. The apparatus. The apparatus. Can we reach it though? Yeah. Watch. I'll, I'll, I'll get the bottle. Uh, can we reach the bottle? Oh yeah. We're yeah. Ready. We're broken, let's forget that. Here, do you want to take that and then I'll take the apparatus? Move the bottles over. Okay. I'll take this and this and we run. So how much does this usually go for? Uh, like a hundred or something. Okay, wait, no, that's not something. This one, watch. 
Maybe. Perfect, though. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and not, no, oh, uh, okay, I'll, I'll try to, how do we do this? Uh, no, we can go back in. But how do we ever get it back? We can just go, uh, I don't know, but we made more money than we would have lost anyway. Uh, I mean, the bees always kill me. Every time I play this game, I get bees. Oh. A little fun fact about this game is that you cannot climb up ladders if you are holding a two-handed object, which means that we cannot get these up onto there unless if we have our ladder back. So, we are just going to have to find a way. Oh my goodness, there was a way this entire time. No, don't tell me I'm stuck here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, come on. Come on, please. Oh, <gasps> yes. No. So, as it turns out, this entire time, there was a ladder right there that we could have easily taken. So, I guess that's on me for not looking around enough. You can kind of, like, climb up. Oh, you know, because I realized after, uh, when I thought about it, I'm like, how did normal people get out there? And with that, after all this practice, we finally felt prepared to tackle one of the hardest moons in the game. And, well, here's how it went. Two inside. Oh god. Oh! That does music. <laughs> how tall am I compared to the lamp? Oh, there's another lamp! Oh! There's another and lamp. there's a bell! I got the bell. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna keep having the lamps because they're full hand running. Okay. Those two <gasps> run, run, run. Look up there. Look up the stairs. This is the Nutcracker. It is one of the most dangerous enemies in Lethal Company. Why is there a Nutcracker? Get over here quick. Can you kill him with the Extendo ladder? Follow me. Do I hold the mask out and kill him? Uh oh. Wait, is there some stuff in here? I think we have enough for quota. Comedy, comedy, comedy. I feel like there's more. We definitely do, but I just want to see what's in here. I don't, I don't know this room. Yeah, we should head back. Go, go, go. I don't know, but just go. Uh, do you have a hand for the bottles? Or yes. Not? Okay. It is time to celebrate, though, and you may think it's because we survived one of the hardest levels in the game. No, it's the fact that we just survived any level and we finally got to go and sell our stuff. figure this out. <laughs> you have to take the stairs by the way. Jeez, I just pressed it once. Come to the stairs. <laughs> Why are the stairs here? I don't know, but they're very helpful for our for our specific circumstances. They are, yeah. <laughs> So, it turns out this is what happens when you throw a mod together in two seconds and don't test it out to see if it's possible. But despite all that, we managed to progress in the game. Now, this isn't a mod I made to release, but I will leave the option to play it yourself with a Google Doc with some extra info in the description. I may return to improve it in the future, but this just gives you all the chance to play it if you would like, and please note that things may mess up with it or not work as intended because it's just a prototype. I hope you all enjoyed the video, and be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you did, as it really means a lot, and I will see you in the next one. I, it must have been, because there's no way I'm moving. I cannot walk. Wait, I made it up. Oh. <laughs> Actual cheater. Nah, that jump's not possible, I refuse.